This your man D Dubs from Tires on Tarmac. What's up, my riders? Back with another video. Back with a legendary vlog. For this bill, for Cherry Bomb, man. Just got off work, YouTube, man. Excuse my appearance, man. I just got off work, man. I'm hitting up. I'm, I'm hustling hard, man. Just got off work and I'm back at work again for my vlogs, man. So, hope y'all day was cool. Hope y'all day was positive, man. I missed it what's going on in our country, but yo, this is what it is, man. Uh, today we got a cool vlog, man. Uh, this is the vlog I told y'all I was going to do. Uh, I already did my Ultima in black and I did my S in black. Now I'm doing the Ultima sign in black. This right here is going to be in black too. We're going to get right into it because as you see, I don't have a whole lot of daylight. We look past it, this damn tree over here that's growing over my yard. This is not my tree, by the way. It's my neighbor's over there. So I got to get going, y'all. But I got primer. The durable top coat high gloss that's what i'm using rust-oleum and then i use a satin black we're going with satin black bonds on wood metal plastic and more ultra cover times two rust-oleum again so that's what we're gonna do now i gotta go to the mart and get some more of this tomorrow i'm gonna get another can of this tomorrow but we're gonna get the vlog started man so let's do it so what we're gonna do is apply even coat on them mosquitoes and shit so we're gonna apply even coat, you know what I'm saying? Get the edges. Get all in the in-between part, shake it up. Sorry for the camera view. Now I'm not a professional, but I'm getting better every time I do this. And my last ones with my man Scott came out pretty good. So yeah, we're gonna let that let that coat clear rest. This is gonna be all blacked out all day. And what I've been doing, y'all, besides taking it off, is getting the uh the old glue off because I'm gonna set it in with the with the new joint uh with our epoxy. Uh what it, it 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 does everything. It uh repels snow, sleet, rain, all that, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, cherry bond coming along. Also, guys, if I ain't tell y'all, man. I got the tire lettering popping. You know what I'm saying? Tire lettering coming in. I'm gonna reveal what tire lettering I got, man, but it's dope, it's different. Ain't nobody in Lake County, definitely, I don't even think in Chicago got this type of tire lettering. I really went unique because there's too many people that's rocking my Nissan color. It's like, ever since I bought this color, it's like I've been seeing a lot more of them, man. So it's a lot of dudes that be biting. They won't admit it, but they be biting. So. Uh, every mod I'm doing is to separate it from other Nissans with the same color and eventually I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it anyway and a crazy wrap It's gonna be Japanese inspired. So it's gonna stay true to JDM and, and my creativity. It's gonna definitely separate it from the rest, but This right here is what I've been doing guys. So You see the Altima and I've been cleaning up around here And you see where I took it off at so I got a little I got a lot more to take off. This is the old glue. Of course I marked it. Scotch tape you want to use so you don't damage your paint. And then this is the S. I cleaned it up a little bit, touched it up. But it's looking good, man. So when that that's gonna be black, that's blacked out. The Nissan's gonna be blacked out. This is blacked out. And yeah, it's gonna be dope, man. You know what I'm saying? And then uh my chrome. Um I'm about to do my chrome wrap. I'm gonna try to do it myself, guys. Ain't no try about it. I'm going to make it happen. And I'll be doing the chrome. Chrome is going to be gone. So we're going to do the chrome all the way around. It's going to be blacked out. Lights in the back going to be blacked out. I'm going with two inch tips in the back. Which is going to fill in that gap perfectly where it's cut out. See how it has a gap? See that, guys? It's not going to be a gap with the tips I'm going to have. They're going to be black tips. They're going to be dope as fuck. And I might go with the racing lettering on it. So when you're looking at my tips, you will see like the sport racing letters on there too. Just give it a little extra. Maybe do it in yellow and red. Cause you know, y'all seen my wheels, man. <laughs> y'all seen that Wu-Tang yellow on them reels. I'm about to, and yeah, by the way, man, stay tuned for that blog, man. We're going to be doing that all day when I mount the rims on this bad boy. It's going to be a glorious day, man. Cherry Mom going to be stunting around the time. Ain't nobody got these rims. That's, that's why I really like the rims I got. Because ain't nobody got them. Everybody rocking 4Gs. But a lot of people got the same 4Gs. Or they're going Corleone Forge. Corleone Forge is dope too. Shout out to Real or Real on that. He got some dope wheels. But I'm not going with no 4Gs and no Corleone Forge. I'm going with something else, which is a nice model. They're based out of Cali. And they make dope wheels. You know what I'm saying? But 
when I put them, get them bitches off, fine, it's gonna be dope. So I ain't even tripping no more. So I got the wheels on deck. Right now I'm just trying to figure out what tire, what type of tire I'm gonna put on there because I gotta go bigger because I got bigger wheels. So stay tuned for that vlog. About a week or two weeks from now, uh, we're gonna be in there and uh, I'm gonna take y'all behind the scenes when they mount it. They gotta do my sensors over because I got bigger wheels on here. It's gonna be dope, man. But a lot of this chrome, guys, is gonna be gone. And bear with me because I'm doing it fast. I only got so much time because the light is getting dim. Yeah, all this is going to be blacked out. So it's going to be like one piece. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be like one piece. Now, what I'm going to do is when I get done with the blacking out of the main chrome all the way around and then my whole grill is all chrome down to the lower lip. I got a chrome joint. My whole face is chrome, which is very unique because I ain't seen nobody really with my face. That's all getting blacked out. That whole moot getting blacked out. It's getting blacked out, man. It's getting blacked out. Uh, I'm probably going to black these out because I don't know if y'all noticed. I got chrome underneath my headlights, too. A lot of Nissans don't have that, too. So I got the chrome joints, too. Um, I might leave the... I might black these out, too. I'm not sure. Depending on how hard it is to wrap these, I'll probably just leave these chrome. So I don't want to spend too time, too much time on it. I might leave a little chrome in there. That little chrome ain't going to be too bad. You know what I'm saying? This chrome is dated, you know what I'm saying? It's all about colors and blacking out shit, you know what I'm saying? In the 21st, so, you know what I mean? So, yeah, if y'all can catch that in y'all membrane, y'all can see where I'm going with it, because you see I already got the black joints right there, you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, you know, but yeah, man, today's vlog is about doing that, man, and just getting the black end on here, and I already got the glue to reset it on it, don't worry. This is what I'm using, guys using this right here right now i'm gonna get some more shit called goof off it's really more better than this it's uh it's a better application than the goo gone but this is what i'm using for now as i ran out of the goo off, goof off uh masking tape is what i use to mask it off and i use plastic I always go plastic guys don't ever go metal on your joint my paint is fucking pretty so you know I always go plastic so yeah guys this is what it is i'm doing the emblem today thought y'all would like that yeah, I had to do that. You know what I'm saying? That's going to look dope because when the emblem's on there and you see the S, the emblem, boom, boom. Yeah, man. It's going to be dope, y'all. I'm really loving it. It's coming along for real. But then we got to, uh, let's go do this black, man. It should be dry enough because it's hot outside. It's humid. So bear with me, guys. Rewind the vlog if y'all want to hear what I'm saying. So I'm talking fast. So rewind the vlog if you ain't catch something as far as wordage. But we're going to go on over here. And catch this other one this other application the black satin we're gonna put the first coat on there and just use the rest of that satin black and like i said i'm gonna pick up another another one tomorrow see what i'm saying whoa look at that just with a little application you can see how i just make that emblem pop versus the chrome side than what it's about to be, that satin black. And I like the satin black because it has that. And see, I go with the gloss, clear gloss, high gloss, same one I put on my rims when I did my Wu-Tang yellow, on my on my gold yellow stars, on my rims. This is what you use, this type of this type of clear. Use the high gloss. So then you get that shine, extra shine when you do the satin. See what I'm saying? And you do. That's how you do it, guy. And that's it. So you don't want to get it too wet. You know what I'm saying? Boom. So that's the first coat. You know what I mean? So you're going to take this, cap it. You know what I'm saying? Let that, that's going to be dope on the whip, boy. See how it shine? When I reapply it, that Nissan in black, that's it, boy. More aggressive look. And then, like I say, guys, when I do the head, the tail lights, uh, it's gonna be hard. Get, definitely when you tint your tail lights, because it's legal in Illinois to tint your tail lights. It's not really legal to tint your headlights, but you can tint your, your tail lights a light dark. And I got the right tint and everything. I got it all in the crib. Uh, I just bought some more, actually, guys. Uh, yeah, man, it's kind in, cause I told you, man, it's time. It's time. I call this. I call this blog the blackout. So this is this is gonna be the blackout. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, it's gonna be hard. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. So I'm scraping this off now. I'm gonna let this. I'm gonna let this go ahead. Do what it do for now. 
and then I'm gonna scrape the rest of this all, clean it all up tomorrow. Got it marked off, of course, with the masking tape where I set it back in perfectly in the middle. And this is gonna be dope, man. Even with that, just, just when you do mods like this from the black to this, guys, this really gives it more of a, you know what I'm saying? Boom, dude, guys, tire lettering coming in. What I'm trying to tell y'all, man, man, I'm killing it. Yo, I'm trying to tell y'all, man, fuck with the channel. If you like what I'm doing on this build, man, fuck with it, man. Fuck with that. Hit that sub button, man. Hit the sub button. Rock with the kid, man. Thumbs up. I don't give a fuck. Mostly get them thumbs up, man. But holla at your boy. Let me know what you think. Taking regular cars and making them dope. You know what I'm saying? You see my neighbor's joint. That car really is dope, but, you know. But anyway, taking regular cars, making them dope. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do, man. And that's what make my channel dope. Because I ain't starting off with no Lambo, no Hellcat. I'm taking a regular joint and making it dope. And it's working. I was out in Mundelein today. It's a suburb out here today where I live at. Motherfuckers looking at Cherry Bomb. I ain't even done with it. I ain't even got, the, I ain't even got my rims on. You know what I'm saying? They ain't even seen the rims. And they looking at it like that. This motherfucker in a damn Audi. He in an Audi TT looking at my shit. You know what I mean? So... You see what I'm saying? So anyway, y'all, um, I'm going to get back to what I got to do. I only got so much sunlight. As y'all see, the sun is setting out here in the Midwest. So uh, rock with y'all tomorrow. I will be uploading all weekend. Another vlog coming. Smack you in the head with another one. I love y'all, man. I know I've been like hitting y'all with fast words, but I only got so much time. I had to do this vlog. I had to upload for y'all. Y'all know what it is. Got much respect and love for y'all, man. I'm going to let y'all see the application when it's done. And I should have this mounted before I go to work Sunday. Hopefully the weather won't be stupid and raining and shit. But either way, it'll be on there by next week. If not Sunday, next week for sure. Because we be getting a lot of rain and stuff. Y'all stay sucker free. Rock with y'all soon, man. Peace.